Welcome, welcome back to my channel. Chicken with Tiffany. Tiffany, see how you live, ladies and guys. Don't today. I hope everyone is doing good. It's a Friday. It's a little gloomy here, but it's okay because God, you woke us up and gave us some joy that you can kind of go ahead and get your little day going on unless you already don't let your joy, your joy go away or you have allowed someone to take your joy. So do not let anyone steal your joy, anything or anyone. <sighs> okay. These buckets, because I'm not, I'm not playing with my prepping. I'm not even, like I said, I'm not playing a fiddle with my prepping. It's very time consuming, so you do not want your prepper to be in vain. And as me, I make sure I've been doing a lot of my research for whatever I need to do to make sure that everything is contained, organized, and kept well. And so, of course, you know, I got my little food grade buckets. But these buckets, it came in two. One, it's a, it's a good thing because you get these buckets, they're $2, but the proceeds is donating so you can explore your website and find out all the information if you agree with their donate or your um proceeds go to go ahead and get them and plus they come with the lid and that was a no-brainer for me so i know you can get them from walmart and places like that but my husband and i was already in there and i've seen the buckets yeah only down part about these buckets if you ever have gotten them they have a older like no other uh older and I don't have, I don't, yeah, I don't bang around. So I'm like, ooh, child, bye. No, I can't do that. But this older, and I can't have it in my house. So this is not so much about how and to store your, your whatever, your pasta, your rice, flour, beans, or whatever. This is basically telling you how to clean it. Now, if anyone else, you know, know how else to, any other way to clean these, please let me know in the comments below. Please, 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 because this is not a smell you want to have your food to even though you might have it in plastic you don't want that dissolved so i use um cold wash bleach and it's not here but i also use real dawn detergent not no palm olive anything like that i just use dawn detergent and cold wash as you can see and it overall it did help the smell. it not only helped it took the smell away so just make sure you use some cold wash and dawn detergent together get this get that butt bucket soapy fill it all the way up soapy you got it because it's inside there but it's soap it's soap because it smells just like some good strong pickles and stuff like that. It's, it's strong. But there are good buckets for $2. You can't beat it. Plus it comes with a lid. So hold on just a second. And as you can see, this is the lid. And then there's just some things that I have that, you know, just to show that what you can put inside it. Chip with Tiffany, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe. Hit, 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 hit that subscribe button. Come on. I like it. Comment, like, and subscribe. I would love to have you part of my family. Go ahead and get your prepping on because, seriously, China, we right behind you. You don't want to say it, but we are. Talk to you, level ladies and guys, later.